Okay, I admit it. I have not prepared a thought-provoking moment of clarity video for August. As you might notice, I appear a little disheveled and unkempt. I'm currently at about the midpoint of a two-week odyssey that took me to my niece's home and her beautiful family in Denver, several days hiking and enjoying the Grand Lake area of Colorado, four days with my rally family over in the dinosaur region of far northwest Colorado, and I'm now reposing in the beautiful Rockies near Steamboat Springs. And I simply didn't want to work on a pithy, thought-provoking missive while I was enjoying this much natural beauty, family connection, and rally excitement. And yet there's some clarity in exactly this evidence that I've been terribly irresponsible. I haven't missed a month of these in over 10 years. It's just a rule with me. I should break away from this wonderful road trip, ponder over what clarity message is appropriate, and work to produce it. The thing is, I just didn't want to. So a possible clarity message could be, sometimes it's okay to bail on a responsibility and enjoy the break, smell the roses, dip my toes in the cool mountain stream, marvel at my beautiful niece and her family, engage with my national rally family, or insert your favorite excuse here. I'm pretty sure you'll be understanding and forgive me for this. As I mentioned, it's been a rule for me for 10 years. This video must be edited and published by 10 p.m. Central Time on the third, or sometimes the second to last, Wednesday of the month. To fail at this, or just about anything else, I find angering. I've broken my own rule. Arrgh! Knowing you'll forgive me is comforting. The question remains, can I forgive myself? And therein lies a possible clarity lesson number two. I think for most of us, forgiving ourselves for the failures and mistakes we make is tougher than forgiving those who trespass against us. I know it's difficult for me. So there you go. No hardcore, action-inspiring video this month. I'm having too much fun. And I'll forgive myself. It's Kim, and this is another moment of clarity.